Hello, everyone. I'm so excited to announce that on behalf of the House Republican Conference, House Republicans have elected Blake Moore as our vice chair. And as chair of the conference, I can't tell you how excited I am to work with Blake. He is a true servant leader. Uh, he is on Ways and Means, as well as the Budget Committee, so a true expert and so passionate about fiscal issues. And I also want to thank all of the candidates. This was a crowded vice chair race, which shows the strength of our team, and it also shows the importance of us being unified. We are unified and committed and energized to work together as a team to continue to deliver results for the American people. Uh, the vice chair and the chair have a very close working relationship, and I'm excited that Blake will be at the leadership table. And again, we'll focus on member-driven initiatives to help get our message out. So I'm excited to turn it over to Vice Chair Blake Moore. Thank you, Chairman Lise. It's been, it's, it's been an awesome experience to, to go through this. And I think you said it best when you said these, are, these roles are so in, they're linked. And uh, the, the key part about this role is um, we need to make sure we empower every single member. And uh, this is a hardworking role. This is a behind the scenes for the most part, which is where I will be very comfortable and uh, look forward for the opportunity to just give it my all. I'm so grateful for my colleagues. The, the experience of running for leadership election, um, you have to step out of your comfort zone a little bit. Uh, amazing people in this race, all very good friends and will remain all good, very good friends and, and will work. They, they all had such incredible ideas that we want to just build on that and find uh, the right ways to communicate. The thing that I wanted to focus on was that a conservative message is a positive, optimistic message. And that's what we need to make sure we do to, to, to win the future. Um, the, the, the conference chair uh, communicates that, and my job will be to make sure that each member has that ability to do so. So thank you. Yeah, I actually talked about three things. Uh, you know, um, big, strong, positive, optimistic message for uh, to win the future. And I have a very hardworking, detail-oriented team. It's a little logistical and everything, but I want to make sure we use that team to then you know, empower others to, to, to have that uh, to have that approach. And that was that was a big part of the message. What do you see as the challenges for yourself in this role, and how you plan to tackle them? Obviously, there's been a, a lot of changes here in the Republican conference in the the last. Uh, we have a document called the Commitment to America, right? Our HR1 was to make sure that we were pushing towards energy independence. Our HR2 was to ensure that we had sound, strong immigration policy. Our HR3 is to make sure we have pro-growth taxes. Those are the things that we're focused on. Those are the things that we're working in our committees every single day to do. Um, the Commitment to America is, lays out the plan and we just need to make sure that we're, we continue to hit things home. It's, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a tough environment in Washington right now. It's a split government type of thing, and we're making and make, creating as many wins as we possibly can as we move forward with this. Last question. What do you think the lesson for Republicans is, and how will you implement this message from the election last night on the issue of abortion? Yeah, so we're, we've, we've maintained a consistent message um, across the board. And as I look back to the things that, that, that Americans care about, every single time that you poll somebody is to make sure that we have a strong economy. That's why I wanted to be on the Ways and Means Committee, and that's why I want to make sure that we're continuing to create pro-growth strategies that address it. This is the, uh, there are so many issues that are out there. We need, you know, and it's different for every single person's district, and so that's what comes back to this role in particular is very much a role that is just going to make sure everybody has a message that they can share, take from the Republican conference, and then tailor it to their districts. We're winning districts, um, and if you look at, our, look at our conference, we're winning districts that are Biden plus 16 to very, very, very conservative messages, each member is empowered to share their own message, and I think they're doing a great job with it. So thank you.